people. Miss your faces so much. Hope you are somewhere safe, healthy, and not too bored. Uh, just a reminder, today is the day that your final drafts are due for your research papers. Uh, you do not need to create anything new. You don't need to upload anything into Google Classroom, but you do need to click that turn in button on our Google Classroom just to let me know that you are finished. All right, so again, make sure that you click that turn in button in Google Classroom as soon as you're done to let me know that you are finished. Uh, you have done such a great job on these things. They are very challenging papers to write, and I am so proud of how well so many of you have done uh, on these papers. I have read so many different papers about so many different interesting topics, everything from horses, basketball, medicine, superheroes, soccer, volleyball, video games, the Israeli-Palestinian conflict, gun violence, cancer, uh, stereotypes, Lincoln's assassination, the Stanford prison experiment, Fortnite, and even Gucci, among other things. Uh, you have done such great work on these. You should be proud. I'm proud of you. Now, some updates on our class going forward. We're going to be starting a new block schedule this week. Uh, it's going to take a little getting used to, but I think it's going to help um, decrease the amount of like busy work that I think we were all experiencing before break. All right, so check out that new block schedule. I'm going to upload it on our Google Classroom and share it with all of you. It is also linked to our class website, which is updated and as fancy as ever. So if you prefer to use our class website to keep track of stuff, you can always do that. I'll have it updated for you um, all the time. Uh, our next unit, we're going to focus on major economic and political systems that emerged uh, during the time period we just finished studying, so around the Industrial Revolution and World War I. Uh, these isms like capitalism, communism, socialism, liberalism, conservatism, when they were first created, dramatically changed the way people thought and dramatically changed the way nations were organized. They are still a part of our every, a huge part of our everyday lives. Um, and so it's important for us not just to understand the history of these isms, but also um, how they impact us today. And that's what we're going to focus on in our next unit before we get to another bad ism, fascism, uh, which leads us to Hitler and Stalin and Mussolini and World War II. All right, that's our plan. More history later. I talk to you soon. Take care, good people.